hurricane season starts in two weeks and we are taking the time to let you know about some changes to how tropical systems are going to be forecasted and what you can expect this season. News 19's meteorologist Corey Smith explains from the National Hurricane Center. Tropical systems are unique. They can spin up off of our coasts or travel an entire ocean before impacting land. This year we will bring you the forecast for tropical weather in a new way. The National Hurricane Center has started to issue extended tropical weather outlooks. You have seen these maps before, but instead of being issued for two and five days out, they will now include a seven day forecast. Along with this change, we're going to start to see some storm surge forecasts, which are now official. This product from the National Hurricane Center will allow us to better communicate coastal impacts from these storms. The tropical forecast cone will not see any major changes this year, but we have seen it shrink in size over the past two decades. When it comes to the actual forecast, since 2005, we have seen the average forecast track error decreasing, in some cases more than 100 miles. The National Hurricane Center says this change allows for more accurate forecasts up to five days out. This trend can be seen in error numbers that continue to fall each year, leading to a better track when hurricanes approach the coast. From the studio, I'm News 19 meteorologist Corey Smith.